You see that paper on the back of the car? It's not what you think it is. In fact, it's a trap. Now, when you come back after you're done with your shopping or visiting or whatever it is, you're not going to walk around the car to actually check. So you're going to get in the car, you're going to get yourself comfortable, put on your seatbelt, start the engine, and just as you're about to move off, you're going to notice that, hey, there's something stuck on the back of my car. So what you are going to do is you're going to come out of the car with your engine running and maybe even the doors open to go check on that paper. And of course, when you least expect it, bam, you're screwed. Now this would usually take place, of course, in a dark and secluded location and preferably near a hump. Why near a hump? Because the robbers want to catch you just as you are slowing down. So you are approaching the hump, you are slowing down and the robbers would throw themselves onto the car and pretend that you have just hit them. Now any sane driver in a situation like this, you're going to come out of the vehicle to attend to that so-called injured victim. But of course, no one is really injured. The only party who is going to be injured, you. Now, I'm sure at some point of time, you would have probably gone to JB and you've probably gotten something fixed and you would actually realise that the Malaysians are really good when it comes to modifying electronics. And that's exactly what this is all about. You see, they invent a keyless system to very cleverly unlock your vehicle and simply hotwire the car and drive off in it. Of course, when you come back to look for your car, it's gone. Introducing the Silent Car Alarm. Today, an increasing number of Singaporeans are protecting their cars with some help from StreetDirectory.com. It's a pretty cool technology that provides you with real-time GPS tracking. Thanks to this, you can now go onto the web or your app to find your vehicle's location in real 